Hello everybody, welcome back to another Blender tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a Minecraft character in Blender and rig him up and animate him. So let's get started. The first thing that I'm going to do is turn on my screencast key so you can see what I'm doing. Now, this cube right here, this is going to be our head and it's in the perfect dimension so we don't have to do anything to it. Alright? But press 1 on the number pad, then 5 to go in orthographic view and we're gonna duplicate this cube a few times let's do the chest first so press shift D and then Z holding control snap it to like right there then press N to open up the properties panel and scroll up to the dimensions and this is what we're gonna change to get the body just right so the X uh, not the X the Y needs to be changed to 1 then the Z to 3. Then press 1 on the number pad and press Z to go into wireframe view and then bring it down and make sure you're holding control because then it will snap it. Now let's do the arms. So press Shift D on the torso then X holding control snap it to right there. Change the X to 1 so the X and the Y are 1 then press G, X, and snap it to right there. Now let's do the legs. So press Shift D, and holding Control, snap it to right there. Okay, so why we aren't doing the other side is because the skin that we're going to be using, we're. I'll, I'll show you guys later, it's kind of hard to explain. But there's half of our Minecraft character. That was pretty easy. The next thing that we have to do is combine all of these together. Alright, so press B, box select all of them, then control J. There we go. Now change this to cycles because that's what we're going to be using. I think we're ready to do the material now. So bring this tab out if you come up to this corner where these little lines are, click and drag, and pull it out. Alright, click the UV image editor and click open. And go find your skin, wherever that would be. Mine is, uh, <laughs> let's see if I can remember where it's at. Minecraft stuff, skins. Alright, I'm going to be using my skin right here. You can use whatever skin you want, it can be yours or whatever, but I'm going to be using mine right there. And click open. And this is extremely small, so you're going to have to zoom in a little bit. Alright, let's UV unwrap this. So press Tab to go into Edit Mode. Then A to select everything. U, Smart UV Project. Hmm. Uh, actually, wait a second. Press, press A, Control E, Mark Seam. Then press U, unwrap. Uh, go into uh, object mode, control A, scale. Let's try that again. Hmm. I guess it will have to work. Okay, so what we have to do now is pretty tedious. We just have to scale this down and line it up to where the head would be. Actually, first, so we can actually see what we're doing, go to the node editor. Press N to get rid of that panel and click this little checkbox right here that clicks use nodes. Alright, press Shift A, texture, image texture, and then plug it in right there. Then you can click this drop down menu and click your image right there. So now if we go into textured view, you can see that the UV map is sort of messed up. But we'll fix that, don't worry. Now come over to this window and press Shift F10. Yeah, Shift F10, and that will that's a shortcut to go to the UV image editor. So now here comes the fun part. <laughs> we have to uh, bring these to every single little thing right there. So right here, this one would go like right there, and we would scale it down and stuff. Um, let's see if I can let. Uh, <laughs> hold on, is it this? Here we go. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. 
let's just move them all out of the way click this face and then drag it up right there and you're gonna have to be zooming out clicking zooming out clicking a lot so scale it down and then place it right there um, da, 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 da. and sometimes the lines are kinda hard to see but just try your best to scale it place it scale and it doesn't have to be perfect like that looks good right there it, it doesn't have to be exactly the same right on the pixels but a shortcut to do that is press shift s and then uh, selection to pixels and that will snap it to the pixels so now it's actually perfect so now let's do the side of the head so right click and then bring it right there scale it down move it up scale it down it's just tedious work like that and then shift s and then to cursor or not to cursor to pixels let's do this side of the head drag it up scale it down scale it down move it shift s cursor to pixels and that's a really handy trick and as you can see right here this one is upside down wait a second yeah it's it's upside down so we gotta rotate it all the way around right there and you can press R to rotate if you didn't know so now let's do the top of the head come over here drag it up zoom in scale Yeah, this part is just really tedious and that that little shortcut right there selection to pixels is super nice so make sure you do that click the bottom one drag it up scale shift s cursor to pixels uh, the back of the head and you can use your own skin you don't have to use mine but I'll put a link in the description to where you can get mine if you just want to use it shift s selection to pixels and this one's upside down so we gotta rotate it right there and holding control you'll snap it to five degree increments so that's pretty handy and so there we go there's my head <laughs> cool so you kind of get what you have to do for all of them let's just do the chest real quick so right click on the chest and then drag it up right there scale down scale it down a little bit right there shift s selection of pixels and so then it's like that okay so what I'm gonna do now is fast forward this part so because you guys don't want to see me doing this all the time so on your own do what I just did so selecting it move it in into place scaling it down right there shift s selection of pixels and after I've finished it we will be right back so see you in a minute Okay, who that took too long. <laughs> Actually, I think I just messed up a little bit. I think this is supposed to be on the inside. Whoops. <laughs> so what is this one? So we'll just change that real quick. Du -du 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 -du. Change this guy right there. Easy enough. All right, so there's our Minecraft character. He's missing an arm and a leg, but we'll fix that in just a sec pretty cool pretty cool pretty cool alright get rid of this by just holding it and then dragging it across press 1 on the number pad so now let's do the other legs and arms and this is a trick that I found out that saves a lot of time if you go into edit mode then click this guy control L it will wait a second L why doesn't it select the whole thing L that's weird hmm okay well we'll just do it manually then just selecting them all 
Uh, we've got to select the inside one too. There we go. Press 1, then change it back to textured view. Press Shift D, and then duplicate it over here. Holding Control to snap it to the location. Snap it to right there. And now it's backwards, so we need to mirror it. And if you press Control M, X, it will mirror it just like that. Look at that. Isn't that cool? And the normals are kind of messed up, so if you press Control N, it will fix it. Look at that. Haha, <laughs> so that saves us from doing the UV map and stuff. So now let's do the bottom one. If you just box select that by pressing B and selecting the top one. And then Shift D, holding Control X right there. Then mirror it by pressing Control M, X. There we go. And the normals are messed up, so press Control N to recalculate them. And look at that. We have our character. Pretty cool, isn't it? And also, one more thing, if you press Shift Z, it is very blurry. Because the image is so small, Blender kind of just like morphs the colors together. And I don't know why it does that, but that's just how Blender works. How we fix this, if you come over here and click Node Editor, and on the Image Texture node, change this to Closest, that will fix your problem. So now if we come back, Shift Z to render it, it's nice and clear. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Okay, so I think this tutorial is going to be two parts. The part modeling and the materials. The next part will be rigging, and that's going to be fun. Oh, man. All right. And also the, the origin is kind of messed up, so if you press Shift, Control, Alt, C, origin to geometry it will snap it to the center that's just so that if you rotate it it will rotate at the center and not down there where it used to be so that just something that I like to do so yeah pretty cool we have our minecraft character so the next part we will rig the character up and animate him a little bit so I will see you guys in the next part thanks for watching goodbye